sexy girl, let me tell you. There's this chick that's been coming into my salon. You know, she got her new ears did all up into jewels and things, and she thinks she is just the sh. No way. I think that I seen her the other day. Oh, girl, you missed a spot on my toe. Oh, yeah, I know. She goes into my cousin's salon all the time with them big doodads all up in her ears. And you know what? She's been stealing the magazines off the rack. Oh, girl, look at this girl that just walked in. She done been to the same place. Only look, instead of jewels, she got flowers all up in her ears. Hi, um, I'd like to get me an appointment to get my nails and my toes done. Do you all have an opening today? <laughs> did you hear her? She thinks she gonna get her nails did. <laughs> Girl, you at the wrong salon. <laughs> now, now, Felicia, calm down. We welcome everyone. Hang on, girl. Let me check my book and see what I got available. Okay, so here's what I've got. Mm, nothing. I'm so sorry. I'm completely booked, girl. But I recommend the one down the street. Um, all right then, thank you. All right, uh, bye-bye, have a lovely day. God bless. Bye-bye, have a good day, girl. Hee-hee, <laughs> we be seeing you, Ern. I just don't know what it is with all these people getting all doodads up in their ears and going and, you know, them used to be our customers. Them used to be our clients and they done turned on us. We're gonna have to break out the glitter. We're gonna have to break out the dough and, like, just start doing every stuff because... I want my magazines back. So hey girls, has anybody heard from the you know what with the you know where's? No honey, I ain't seen hiding her hair nor ear of them today. Hee <laughs> hee, and guess what, we got all our magazines on the rack too. Well, I was just thinking that maybe today we could just, you know, put out a sign with some drinks, you know, try to get a little bit of publicity, you know, maybe get some new clients. Like a good idea. You go ahead and make your signs and things, and I'm gonna go ahead and open up these shades. I think I've seen some lady out here wait. Good morning. I would like to make me an appointment. Do you all specialize in any ear decorations or like any type of applying anything to it? You salon. I just can't believe that's such a thing. Like, why would anybody want to mess up their ears and put flowers and diamonds and things all up in there? Like, it's just not natural. Lord, these young little cheerings just don't know nothing. They just, these poor little cheerings are just the first thing that someone does. I'm going to jump off the bridge, too. Well, thanks anyways, but yeah, I'm going to go check somewhere else because I really wanted my ears to be all sparkly and pretty because I'm sparkly. <laughs> Shine bright like a diamond, honey. Yeah, you just you go on. You go get them sparklers. <laughs> hey, um, I would need an appointment. Yeah, I got this thing popping up on my face because you know, like I've got a little bit of a cold. <sighs> oh my dear. <laughs> okay, honey, let me see what I got available. Okay, just one second. Yeah, sorry, I'm booked. <laughs> I have nothing. I'm sorry. You can try me back next week. Have a lovely day. But your salon is empty. Empty. Why nobody's here? And you tell me you're booked up? Yeah, girl. When we say we're booked, we're booked. Just because these seats is empty don't mean my personality ain't sitting on each and every one of them. Mm -hmm. Bye, Felicia. It's gonna be one of them days, girls. Just get everything out. Let's get this fundraiser going. Let's try to bring in some new clients. Come on, we got this. Oh, my damn. Sparkly ears, 9 o'clock. Check the magazine rack. Count them magazines, girls. Mm -mm, I ain't losing no more ragged zines.